Demystifying Research, Quantitative and Qualitative Approaches. Hello learners! Today, we'll dive into a key topic in academic and professional vocabulary, specifically focusing on education and research vocabulary. Our topic of the day is quantitative and qualitative research. These are important terms used in the field of research and it's crucial for us to understand them well. So, let's get started. Quantitative research is a research method that deals with numbers and hard facts. It's used to quantify the problem by generating numerical data or data that can be transformed into usable statistics. When you think quantitative, think quantity. It's about measurements and numbers. On the other hand, qualitative research is primarily exploratory research. It's used to gain an understanding of underlying reasons, opinions, and motivations. It provides insights into the problem, helps develop ideas or hypotheses for potential quantitative research. When you think qualitative, think quality. It's about understanding the nature or qualities of a phenomenon. Let's look at some examples. If you're conducting quantitative research, you might conduct a survey to understand how many students in a school are interested in continuing to tertiary education. You'll gather specific numbers or percentages. But if you're doing qualitative research, you might conduct in-depth interviews with students to understand their motivations for pursuing or not pursuing tertiary education. You're not looking for a number here, but a range of ideas, thoughts, and motivations. Choosing between quantitative and qualitative research methods depends on the question you're trying to answer. If you need to know how many or how much Quantitative research is the way to go. It provides numerical data that can be statistically analyzed. If you want to explore a topic more in depth and understand the why or how, qualitative research is a better choice. It provides richer, more detailed data that can help you understand the context or deeper motivations. There you have it, a brief overview of quantitative and qualitative research methods. As we've seen, both have their place in research and are used for different purposes. Remember, it's not about which method is better, it's about which is most suitable for answering your research question. We hope this video has been helpful in your journey to understand and master professional vocabulary in education and research. Keep learning! and we'll see you in the next video.